All right, now one local winemaker is approaching nearly two decades in the winery industry. Our Ryan Lusheen visits the owner's winery to talk business. Nice. Milo Marcus Winery has been in business for six years, and Kevin Medeiros is reflecting on what made him get into the business. For him, that's friendship. One of my best friends got me a job, a summer job up on Putin Bay at Heinemann Winery, and um, so I followed him up there and worked there for a couple summers, and I ended up uh, staying there and working there for about 14 years. Then he started growing a family in Bowling Green. I started having children with my wife, and, and we bought a house here in Bowling Green. Just decided I wanted to break out and start my own, and I uh, was lucky enough to find a great location here in downtown BG and uh, get started. Milo Marcus Winery is named after two lifelong friends of Kevin Medeiros, given the theme of friends and family getting together for delicious wine. Milo was uh, the greatest dog in history. She was a vineyard dog. She liked to play frisbee and fetch up on the vineyards on Putin Bay with me. My friend Marcus um, is the one who got me involved in the wine business, so uh, we just thought it appropriate to name it after our best friends. And that's what the winery is all about, wine and friendship. We have regular customers and then new customers and, and always bringing in uh, you know, their story and I get to tell my story back to them and, and uh, it's really nice to, to meet people. Looking forward to the year of 2024, Medeiros says he hopes to make new wines and cocktails for the BG community. Reporting in Bowling Green, this is Brian Lusheen for WTOL 11.